Here's a look at what's making legal headlines tonight. An update on the battle over the restrictive abortion ban in Texas. The Department of Justice says it'll ask the Supreme Court to temporarily block the six-week ban. The DOJ wants the law halted while legal challenges play out. This comes after a federal appeals court ruled Thursday that the ban could remain in effect. The law prohibits abortions after six weeks and also allows private citizens to sue providers or anyone who assists a woman in having the procedure. Philadelphia becomes the first city in the country to say its police officers will no longer be pulling over drivers for certain low-level traffic violations. BNC's Astrid Martinez is in Philadelphia with more. It's a groundbreaking law, and the bill sponsor hopes that it ends racial profiling and addresses what has been called as driving while black. Stops for minor traffic infractions led to the high-profile police killings of black drivers in recent years, like Sandra Bland, Philando Castile, Walter Scott, and Duante Wright. Philadelphia driver Shamar sees a need to overhaul policing in the country. I was in a car with my brother, and um, I think we, we had made an illegal U-turn, and they just got out the car, guns drawn, for whatever reason, kept asking if we had drugs at the time just kind of uncalled for in my opinion. Seeking to end racially biased policing, lawmakers in Philadelphia did just that. This week, legislators passed a bill that addresses racial profiling by preventing police officers from pulling over drivers for minor traffic violations. The bill's sponsor, City Council member Isaiah Thomas, said in a statement, these bills end the traffic stops that promote discrimination while keeping the traffic stops that promote public safety. This approach seeks to redirect police time and resources Resources towards keeping Philadelphians safe while removing negative interactions that widen the divide and perpetuate mistrust. I think the police should be handling like major things. Thomas's legislation classifies seven violations as not enforceable by police stops, including driving without an inspection or a registration that is visible or with a single tail light out. Instead, officers can write citations that will now be mailed to the drivers, giving motorists like Shamar much more peace of mind. A lot of brown people do tend to get pulled over more often, but if, I think I feel like if you're doing very small offenses, you can just send me a ticket or something. I, I don't think it deserves an interaction with the police. Data has shown that Philadelphia police pull over 72% of black drivers in the city compared to only stopping 15% of white drivers. According to that same data, only a small percentage of these traffic stops result in an officer confiscating any kind of contraband. The changes would still allow stops for speeding, running a stop sign, and tinted windows. This new bill goes into effect in 120 days. I'm Astro Martinez for Making the Case.